Hello there everyone. I hope you are having a good day. And I'm back again with another video, but this time we are going to solve a past paper. Specifically, if I tell you the reference of the paper, this is October November 2004, question number 1, paper 4. And if you can see in this question, the examiner is saying the apparatus shown in figure 1.1, that means a reel of thin wire, plasticine and meter rule graduated in millimeters is used to determine the value of average diameter of the wire on the reel the wire is flexible and it has an average diameter of 0.8 mm describe how you would use the apparatus to obtain the accurate value for d that is diameter in your answer you should include there are a b c d e five steps through which examiner is asking the question so let us first observe the procedure through the video so in order to find out the diameter of thin wire according to the question we have set of uh, apparatus that is a ruler instead of blue tack i am using a scotch tape or a paper tape and a thin spool of wire so now in order to find out the diameter first we need to uh, fix one end of the wire over the ruler like this and then we need to wrap the wire exactly over the 0 cm mark as you can see the wire is very thin which means that the error might take place here so in order to avoid error what we are going to do we need to wrap the wire multiple times around the ruler during the wrapping process please keep one thing in mind the wrapping should not overlap with each other or there should be no gap between the wrappings of the wire sensible number of wrapping should be 10 you can have more wrappings or more the 10 you can have 15 20 wrapping but the sensible number is 20 now we are going to have an average diameter which it does not have that much error as compared to the single uh, diameter of the wire as you can see the reading is around 1.1 cm so 1.1 cm covers 10 trapping that means 10 diameters in order to find out the diameter of single wire we need to divide 1.1 cm by 10 that is 0.11 cm is the diameter of single wire now keep one thing in mind the values are just for the demonstration might be possible question will give you its own set of values so this video is just for the demonstration purpose now let's go back to the question so now we have seen the procedure through which we can find out the average diameter of thin wire now we can answer the questions step by step part a state the procedure you would use as we have set of apparatus um what we can do we wrap the wire on 0 cm mark of ruler and observe the diameter second question is state what measurements you would make as we know that the wire is very thin so single uh, wrapping of the wire will uh, cause an error avoid error what we do we wrap the wire multiple times wrap the wire multiple times 
around the ruler. Specifically, if I tell you how many times, 10 times you need to wrap the wire around the ruler to avoid error as much as you can. Part C, explain how would you make the measurement to obtain more accurate value for D. First, we need to fix starting end of the wire using tape or plasticine. And we need to avoid parallax error. Now, part D, explain how would you calculate the value for D. If you go towards the procedure part through the video, 10 wrappings uh, corresponding to 1.1 centimeters. So what we do, divide total length by number of wrappings. In that way, you will have the diameter as the total length by number of lap wrappings. And finally, explain how your method gives the average value for D. Since in our method, each and every wrapping is uh, accumulating some sort of length. That is why it's an average method. That is why So I hope now you have understood the concept clearly If you do, do not forget to like the video and subscribe the channel And push the bell icon so that you don't have to miss any future video May God bless you Thank you